three, go. Yeah. Alright, what phase you got? Okay, first I got first quarter blue. I have full moon, waxing dew, a new moon, and a waning moon. Alright, explain each one. Okay, the first quarter moon is a quarter moon in the phase of a moon when, when one quarter of the moon is lifted up and the light side shine on half of the moon. Um, a waning moon is when a, a waxing moon starts to fade a little and then it starts taking some of the light away from it, causing it to shine this part. Alright, the waning moon is when the light shines off of it and takes some away. We're gonna, uh, the new moon is like, it's the first moon. You can't see it because none of the light, because it hasn't been close enough to the sun for the light to shine off the sun to the moon so you can see it. A waxing vivus is like when the um, waning moon is leaving, the light is leaving, but the waxing moon is like coming back. Like it's the, the moon is moving, so it's causing the light to come and fill the moon up a little bit more. All right, finish. Mm -hmm. And those are what phases of the moon? They are uh, different phases of the moon. There are five phases of the moon. Mm -hmm. Let's not, let's not, so we can get over this quick. We are running out of time. So, one of the cabinet words was celestial body. So, a celestial body is anything above or past Earth's atmosphere. That means usually anything in space, planets and stars. So, is a dog considered a celestial body? No. no. Why you say yes? You about to say yes? Why? Hey, hey, let her ask why. Um. All right, go ahead. Go ahead. New moon. And what's the new moon? Oh. Alright. What's it called? I can't remember. I got first quarter. Tell me about the first quarter. What is the first quarter? It's like a half of a moon. Alright. Show me, show it to me. All right, full moon. Tell me about full moon. I have the same cookie and the same moon. I did. The wedding moon is when the moonlight is decreased. Shalom. All right, what's what you did? I did the new moon. All right, what's that new moon? Uh, oh, wait, we're not sure. All right, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'll come back to you. What's wrong? And tell me about last quarter. Hey, 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 it's half of the moon. Half of the moon. So that's half of the moon, but I had another quarter. I have a what? What type of moon? Full moon. I can't eat it now. A new moon is the face of the moon. When it is in the sun and the earth. Oh, you see. And it looks to be You're supposed to have that in your head, not reading off the. I didn't have moon. Hey, did you take me off? What's the half moon? Um, half of moon. Meaning? Uh, half moon. But what is the half moon called? No, it's not. It's called a what? Oh, I think I know. 
No, she need to know. I don't know. Go ahead, Ronald. First quarter of the moon, that means that half of the quarter of the moon is done and it's not finished. All right. Um, I got the new moon and it means when the moon is going to be perfect. So, this is a waxing gibbons. Between the waxing gibbons and between the half and fall, and, uh, fall moon, waxing gibbons is getting bigger. I mean, me too. Huh? Me need to give me time of reflection, receive me, and forgive me. Uh, uh, no! Okay. Hey. This, this is a waxing, a waning crescent, and it means when um, the moon is getting smaller and it's like forming into a crescent shape. Alright, good job. It's okay, you still get it. And it means it's the last phase of the moon. It's the last phase of the moon. Alright, which one did you do? What's the new moon? It's when the moon has the sun and it looks like this. All right, we're going to go first, first before we start. All right, class, cabinet. Class vocabulary. Waiting on you. Waiting on you. Waiting on you. So the, the, the review vocabulary is uh, celestial body. We know celestial body is anything of past Earth atmosphere. So Craig, can a dog be considered a celestial body? No. Hey, can a dog be considered a celestial body? Can a dog be considered a celestial body? Ms. Ferris, can a dog be considered a celestial body? All right. That's why we do vocabulary every day. Celestial body is anything that is past the Earth's atmosphere. How can a dog be considered a celestial body when he's on the Earth? A celestial body is usually anything that is past the Earth's atmosphere, usually planets, stars. If it's here on Earth and you can see it, it's not a celestial body. So again, Ms. Craig, can a tree be a celestial body? No. no. All right. Can an airplane be a celestial body? No. 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 You can see an airplane, right? It's not past Earth's atmosphere. Anything that is in space, that means past Earth's atmosphere. Can the sun be a celestial body? Yes. Can the moon? Yes. Can the star? Yes. Okay. Your next is new moon. A new moon is a phase of the moon when it passes between the sun and the earth. So what do you mean by that pass between the sun and the earth? That means for the new moon to show, they have to be lined up perfectly where? Between each other. So the day lab we're about to do is sit down. The day lab we're about to do is the Oreo lab. What's going to happen is that he is going to pass you guys out a bag of Oreos, it's going to be five, five, third. It's going to be five cookies in, in the bag. You all should already wash your hands. Take one Oreo out per person and choose a phase, sir. Go wash your hands. Go ahead. And choose one phase of moon, of the moon. Each person should be more than one person with one, with more than one phase of the moon. That means Corey going to have phase one. He's going to have phase two. He's going to have phase three. He's going to have phase four and he's going to have phase five. Since y'all already washed your hands, you go ahead and pass them out of the bag. <laughs> so each person get one Oreo. Each person get one Oreo. So get your Oreo out. Each person decide which phase of the moon that you're going to cut. Put on a napkin. You have it right here. Your plate for you to use. Mm -hmm. Put two plates per table. Mm -hmm. Give them give two plates per table. All right, raise your hand if you're ready to show your moon. No, 
All right, which moon you did, Gabe? The half moon? What you know about the half moon? He just stole my cookie. What I know about the half moon? He stole my cookie. All right, which one? Which one of yours? Half moon. Let me see. I got my cookie. Let me see. Which one? It's Tell me about the half moon. The half moon is a new quarter of the month. All right. What phase that you do? He gonna put in. Hey, ninety. What phase? What phase you at? Quarter and a half moon. Tell me about the quarter and a half. The quarter moon is where half of the sun light reflects to the moon. Half of the sun light reflects to the moon. What moon did you do? Half moon. No, I'm talking half. What moon? Tell him about the quarter. The quarter is the moon. I can eat one quarter of the moon. I can eat it, Mr. Jones. Tell him about the new moon. The new moon is the phrase of the new moon when it between the sun. Alright. Alright, which one you did, Craig? I did a quarter moon. Tell him about the quarter moon. Huh? You did what? Tell me about the half a moon. I'll come in my first quarter. Oh, go ahead. Tell me what's going on. Hey, Paris, you take over? The first quarter of the Go ahead, help him out. Help him out. Help him out. So, what side is that one? All right, and yours is what? Well, tell me about the new moon. Tell me about the quarter moon. All right, tell me about the new moon. Tell me about the quarter moon. I can't hear you. Show me, show me. Two, three. Ronald, nobody can hear you, Ronald.